Welcome to another episode of Timmy Talks, the channel where we talk old school magic. And today I want to talk about comic books with you because I've got more comic books in the mail and I'm really, really thrilled about it. Last month I got this beautiful comic book in the mail um, published by Armada Comic Books. And um, yeah, that was kind of special because I knew very little about these comics. And this is number two in a two-part series uh, that tells the Fallen Empire stories. And the cool thing about this is there are tokens that you can use, tokens made for the Fallen Empire expansion that you can use when you're playing with your Fallen Empire card. So it's really, really cool. Now, this is still really nice, all wrapped up and fresh, right, um, in plastic. And this was sent to me by Petra. And um, I went to a tournament and I would, somebody came up to me and said, here you go. And gave me this package. Now, I've already looked inside, but I also wanted to share it with you. So these are more comics sent to me by Petra. So I really, you know, thank you so much. I, I have to send you something back now, I kind of feel like. Um, but yeah, you're, you're being very, very generous. I really, really appreciate it. Um, let's have a look because I just want to share it with you because there are more comic books in here from Armada and because uh, they made more comics in the 90s and they're all uh, magic related. The cool thing is there are actually um, counters in here as well. So let's just first look at the cover. So this is Magic the Shadow Mage. And um, this is number four in October. And I believe when I'm looking at these counters that these are connected to Ice Age. But I could be wrong, so please tell me if I'm wrong. This is kind of like a beating heart, is it not? And and, and these remind me, I, I don't know the name of the card right now, but these really remind me of an Ice Age card. Isn't the card called Time Bomb? I think it's called Time Bomb. It's got really cool art with a skeleton on it. I think this is from or tokens to be meant to be used with that card time bomb, but I'm not sure. Um, I've got another one here. Look at this again, those same counters. I see, what do I see? Yeah, is this a little, like a little frog coming out of an egg? It's kind of hard to see. I'm definitely going to look up what these counters are about. We see minus one, minus O counters, minus O minus one counters. And when we turn it around, it is Magic the Gathering number four of October. And this is Ice Age. Okay, so these are definitely connected to Ice Age. It's really cool, Petra, that you're giving me Ice Age comic books now because we actually have an Ice Age tournament coming up. So thank you so much for sending these. And uh, two of these. And also, and I'm really happy with that, we've got some opened comic books. And that means we can just have a look. Let us judge dread. Wow. Take the law into your own hands. June 95. How sweet. Genesis games. Man, those were the days. Ice Age Armada number two. Wow. Really nice. I'm going to open it up. Let's have a look. Look at that art. It's opening a random page here. Amazing. It's the art of those days. So kick-ass. I'm definitely going to read this. I'm really going to enjoy it. Thank you for sending these over, Petra. Oh, look at this. Okay, I've got, I'm going to get the camera for you. I'm going to show it to you. Look at this art. Wow. How cool is that? Really, really, really a big fan of this. So many details, and I'm sure if I kind of dive into Ice Age, I'll recognize a lot of characters here in this comic book, and I can connect them to the Ice Age set. The cool thing about Ice Age is that when it got released, the idea really was to kind of start magic all over again. This was supposed to be the new alpha, the new core set, a new beginning for Magic the Gathering. And, uh, and that's why Ice Age is such a strong, like, world of its own. It's like you don't even need cards from other expansions, I feel, when you're looking at Ice Age. Um, and then we've got another comic. So this seems to be from a different era, maybe a little bit earlier. We see, could this then be a giant spider, maybe? This is a Herlu Minotaur, of course. Let's open it up and let's have a look. 
What's happening here? Look at that. Wow. The world is called Dominaria. The land is known as Stonehaven. It is late summer, 1280, by the reckoning of the sages of Minaret, deep in the slums of Arathoxia. Wow. Ooh, what's happening here? Giant spider coming in. A minion of Revedel. Wow. Look at the eye. Look at the jaws on that spider. Gruesome. Wow. Um, if you know anything about these comics, of course, I'm going to do some research. So I'll get a little bit more knowledgeable on the topic of Armada comics. But please let me know in the comments below. Who summons Sings to Ways Minotaur of Herloon? Wow. So the Herloon Minotaur comes. Wow. It's just so, so much happening. And <laughs> we're just on what, page three? A huge fight with a spider. I also love to um, see like the, the advertisements in these. Look at this, Birthquake Aftershocks. I love it. I feel like this style art was really at its best in the 90s. It's, you know, today it's just not the same. I'm sure there are very talented and good artists, but just the whole era of magazines and comic books kind of feels like a bygone era to me. And uh, I just love diving back into it with these pieces of art. I mean, look at this. Absolutely stunning. Okay, so this was the mail day I wanted to share with you. So we have no... Um, we have no magic cards, but we do have a lot of magic comic books from Armada. Petra, thank you so much for these. Um, I'm definitely going to send you something back. Not sure what yet, but I'm going to dive into my cupboards. Going to see if I can send something back to you. Thank you so much for sending this over. And I would also like to thank you for watching another episode right here on Timmy Talks, the channel where we talk old school magic. And if you enjoy this, please leave a like, leave a comment. Let me know what you know about these Armada comic books. And see you next time. What shall we do with the drunken sailor? What shall we do with the drunken sailor? What shall we do with the drunken sailor?